Hello everybody. So this is going to be my finally, finally going to be my attempt at all of the trials. Uh, I've been a little slow on coming to this because uh, I didn't find two things. I didn't find prophecy to be my favorite season and also I didn't really care for the trials. Granted, I never tried the trials on my own. I only tried them on live stream, which uh, because I definitely have a bit of a uh, high expectations of myself to be able to perform on stream and I'm not very good at the trials. <laughs> I never even tried them on my own. So this is actually the first time I'm trying them on my own. And this will serve as both a you know, guide to the trials such as you will get from me, and also a run through completing the Cave of Prophecies. So the Cave of Prophecies is in Isle of Dawn, and it's this little cave through the clouds on the far side. You need emotes from forest to get in here, two emotes from forest to get in here. So a new player will not be able to get in here. And then you run through here, and there's a lot of little, oof, I'm having trouble flying for some reason, a lot of tr uh, little glyphs and things that light up as you pass by. So for those who love the lore of Sky, this has been kind of a bonanza for them. So this, uh, the, the trials were all introduced with the cave, of, with the uh, season of prophecy, which focused on the lore of the game. Again, still a lot of interpretation, you know, room for interpretation of it, because all you get is glyphs and pictures and drawings, and uh, it's quite cool. So of course, just like with um, Sanctuary and with Forgotten Ark, this will be repeatable. In fact, this is actually, I did, well, this was recorded in beta, it's recorded after the season is finished. So you can see my cave is quite empty. So our little quest master will remain. And we will click on him and he will say embark on the first trial. So the first trial is the trial of water. Uh, this went through several iterations in beta. I think mostly they played around with the difficulty of all of them, which was for me was like, just don't make them more difficult because I have a hard time with them all. Uh, one thing is they are harder as a chibi. So wearing the chibi mask is maybe not the best idea on your first run through the trials. Uh, chibi mode is definitely hard mode in them. That game company was fond of saying that in, during the early beta, was chibi mode is hard mode. Well, it's definitely hard mode in the trials, at least water, probably earth, and maybe air. Uh, I'm not sure it makes a difference in fire. I don't know. Maybe it does. So here we have the entrance to trial of water. It was really nice to be solo for me in doing this because then I got to see every single thing. As you can see, there is a winged light at the end of every trial. He's way off there in the distance. And here, of course, you're looking for these little markers, little statues. And you've got to wait. The, the, the water raises and lowers. Hit a marker. That one was really close. Um, all right, so now our next marker, you can see is to the left of that little thing there, and everything is covered. So I'm gonna wait till the water lowers, and then run straight over there, and light. And that's really all this is, is sitting and looking ahead to where you are safe, like right there and then aiming for that. Of course, I have another another uh, statue here, which makes me a lot closer to that little spot. Uh, 
And what, I think what makes chibi harder is that you don't have as, as long a jump or as easy a jump. So uh, shorter legs. See, there's a statue right there with no safe spot around it. This is really just timing and patience. And this one's not so bad with a group because there's nothing to com to complete without a, with a with some of the other trials, you can complete things without other people around, and then it, it can be confusing, especially in Earth. The Earth trial with people completing the puzzle ahead of you is a little weird. So um, this one's ra ra rather easy in a group. Air, I would say Earth is the hardest one in a group. It's very easy to get confused in. Uh, fire also would be hard in a group. But it's hard solo, too. <laughs> Fire is just simply hard. So again, observing where I want to go. This floats, so it's a safe spot. Again, just observing what's what's happening and what's floating. You can see things floating, which means there's safe spots. And I am editing out some of my misses um, just because of time. I think this one took me several attempts before I finally got it. Mostly because I was trying to figure out which way I was I wanted to go. So again, it's some of it's trial and error. Just don't get turned around. One time I did get completely turned around. And ended up going backwards. So I'm thinking... I want to head that way, except I don't want to jump in the water. There we go. <laughs> I, this was three times, I think, before I finally got it. Okay, four. <laughs> there we go. Okay, you can see there's another statue along oh, on the other side there. And there's a dry spot on both of those ramps, but now it's a question of which way I actually want to go. There's a, there's a statue over there. So that looks like the way I need to go. Up to the top 
for this thingy. And then up to the top of that thingy. And of course, not sliding off of those things is challenging as soon as you land on it. So once you get the hang of this though, it's, it's not that bad. Once you kind of get an idea of what you're looking for and what you're, you don't need to be worried about, like the rotation of the things, of the, of the little icebergs, you don't have to worry about so much. Things that appear to be tricking you and aren't really that big a deal. And here we go. I think the challenging part about this one is just not sliding off. Because it is icy, as you'll see. Icy. And here we are. That is the end. So this is the first trial. You do get a winged light at the end of it. And then you get a nice little animation in the cave. to go to get that star. Wing the light. Wisdom of patience, return to the season guide. Now he's just a prophecy guide. It's not a season anymore. The first symbol on the little on the little fire there. And you get more waterfalls. And water there. That game company is really fond of water everywhere. Must be their favorite animation. So then, because we're doing the full prophecy cave, we're going to go down here, back to the Prophecy Guide. And that is that. Then we would move on to the second trial. And that will be 
a different video as you can see hearts cost candles if you do this after the season has ended isn't that nice they were free during the season okay so next video will be trial of earth <laughs>